What's up, what's up, everybody? Henry from Fun Game Reviews. Let's get started with Drake Knight here. And you guys can see, uh, this is currently how my lineup looks like. I am going to be trying to tank it out with Arcane Caster. Uh, I'm going to be doing as much as I possibly can here. Uh, you know what, instead of using uh, the wolf there, let's go ahead and use uh, Toxic Shaman instead. Hopefully this will really, really boost my damage. I'm not 100% sure how well this will work. I mean, Drake Knight really is the real deal. He is going to be a lot harder. So let's go ahead and assault right now. So here we go, guys. Uh, let's get started. Let's do that damage. All right, so here we go. We are going in for the initial push. Let's go ahead and bring it down there. Boom, shaka laka. And we are going to be going all the way, boys. All the way. So let's go ahead and get that Abyss Demon damage in there. Very nice. Ooh. She is going down. Man, she is going down. So I might have to... Ooh, she got knocked out. She got knocked out real quick. Damn. All right, so let's go ahead. Let's go bring it back. Let's go ahead and use the Divine right now. Let's see how well this actually works out. Uh, I mean, you guys know that when she does die, come back. She does come back with that extra bit of attack rate boost comparably. Uh, so this could work out in my favor uh, that she did go down first. But we'll see. Right now, we're going to have to play the cards right. We're going to see how well this works. Let's go ahead top off my Rainy Vin. And let's keep doing that damage. Right now we're we're hitting like seven thousands. I'm hoping to see like five digit numbers. When I see five digit numbers, I'm gonna go ahead and use my abyss uh, demon. Like like I said, if I saw five digit numbers, I'm gonna go ahead and use it. Oh, even though I used it not as high as I was expecting, man. I was not doing as much as I was hoping for. Let's go ahead and put that uh, uh, Toxic Shaman bubble right back down. We got to make sure that we got enough heals. And let's keep on pushing, man. We pushing hard, hard, hard. So here we go. 25 seconds left. Let's go ahead and officially do that divine pushback. We really want to push as much damage as we can. This uh, final few moments here. Uh, we got Toxic Shaman bubble down. We got big heals. We got Abyss Demon swinging away, and so far looking good, man. So let's go ahead and try to see. Top that off. And one more shot, please. One more shot. Oh, 22.9. We got 22.9. Dang it. So that probably means that, you know what, because she does kind of have to, she does take a lot of damage. She does go down rather quickly there. She really, really does. Um... We really gonna have to use a Pangoli here. I mean, that's gonna really dramatically drop my my damage. That will dramatically drop my damage pretty heftily. Um, let's see. Maybe maybe if I did it like that, she she could be potentially okay. I mean, look at that. I mean, she is getting an additional fifty percent attack boost comparably to uh, Arcane. I mean, RK would be given what? You know, let me see. Uh, she would be given 12% bonus. Oh, technically, that's 60% more damage. So, literally, she's actually better because it's 5 people times 12. So, that's 60% damage boost comparably to uh, the Skull Mage here. So, uh, you know what? But regardless, we, we might need to have that extra bit of survivability. Let's go ahead and do it like that. And... Um, Instead, who can I use to try to do that reflective damage? I'm going to go ahead and... I am going to go ahead and give that reflective damage to my Abyss Demon. Maybe, I just maybe, this might work better that I'm using Abyss Demon with reflective power. Uh... Oh, wait, that wasn't reflective power. It was uh, these two. Hmm. 
let me let me hold on let me see how this could potentially work out if i actually were to use uh safrix it's probably not as good if i did use this girl it would be better but i would have to put blockhead in the center here let me put blockhead in the center and then let's go ahead and use uh let's use her hopefully let, let, i don't know let's actually try it out i mean i know that my best demon hits really 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 fast so hopefully that actually like can compensate uh for just like the just in case like oh my god moments you know like i need massive heal moments you know uh having that enchantress does really help but we'll see all right let's go try this out let's see if this actually gives us even more damage just because we are focusing on damage here so here we go guys let's try it out and well, well i mean this is it's always nice to try tests and 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 see if this all stuff works out properly according to plan or if there's a little bit of leeway if there are some problems if there are some flaws and stuff like that you know you definitely want to catch that stuff really early on as quickly as you possibly can so uh so let's go ahead let's do that reflective oh my gosh she is going down She's going down hard. Oh, my gosh. She lived. <laughs> oh, dude. She lived because of that uh, Pangoli Divine there. Legitimately, she lived only because of that reason. Because um, she hit zero. You can see. You definitely saw that she freaking hit zero. Like, all the way down to zero. Uh, but here we go. We are pushing nicely. She is doing big damage. Abyss Demon is hitting and big, big crits. Big numbers. We are hitting in the three, four, uh, three to five digits. So let's keep moving. Let's keep doing it. Here we go. We are doing pretty darn good. All right. All right. So let's go ahead and put a bubble down. And we are continuing to move along nicely here. Ooh. We got 40 seconds left. We are doing tremendously well. I'm kind of waiting to see if he has his, his ads pop out. If his ads do pop out, I definitely want to have it where uh once the ads pop out i do take advantage uh with the divine so does he have ads i th i swear to god he had ads but let's go ahead we're at 20 seconds left that we don't have a lot of time left so we're gonna have to just go ahead and pop it and make it so that everybody starts pushing that big damage big money moves yeah big damage big damage come on reflect it reflect it hard girl let's go Man, really, If I, the fact that I, I really took away that extra bit of damage, that ref, I mean, yes, the survivability there is there, but I mean, dude, I did about a million damage less than I should have. Um, that really blows. That really, really blows. I want to have maximum, maximum, maximum damage. Like, I really want maximum damage. Um let's go ahead we'll, we'll we'll play like this we'll have to play it out kind of like this i know she might hit zero but i know she has more hp doing it like that oh you know what let's go ahead and put in a stronger berserker in there maybe having it where he she has the best berserker might actually give a little bit more damage i don't actually know we'll we'll, we'll actually try that out and then we'll we'll play it out this way and see if that actually works nicely and works well I know I'm also gimping out um, my Amber a little bit because she has a lot less uh, overall power. Uh, but I mean, I'm kind of doing this because what if uh, that actually works out really, really well? That would actually be really, really cool. So let's go ahead. Let's do this. And let's go ahead and push. So let me see here. Uh, who did I put in here? Who did I have here? uh it was it was bullhead there we go all righty all right so here we go we are going in let's go and attack the last assault here this better give me some major fat damage i am praying 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 for some big fat freaking damage and i'm hoping that this works out all right all right so here we go put that uh dot down we got that push Let's go ahead and start doing Abyss Demon Divine here. We're doing great. We're going to put a bubble down. And let's go ahead and use that Divine to do a little bit of pushback action. Hopefully, maybe I do it a little earlier. Maybe my Arcane Caster might actually survive 
uh, just long enough. That way actually worked out that she lived just long enough. Having that extra amount of HP really actually allowed her to to live that much longer. Look at that. The fact that I was using her as a tank and I'm also using her to do that reflective damage. That works perfectly. Oh my god, that worked perfectly. Nice. I know that my Ambro did definitely get weaker, but the whole point of this is that my Arcane Caster is the main source of damage right now. The main, main, main source of damage. So we are trying to take advantage of it and abuse that as much as we possibly can. Uh, so there we go. We got Bubbles down. We got heals from Abyss. We got heals from Arcane. Oh, hell yeah. This one's definitely going to be doing good damage. This one's going to be good, good damage. All right. So officially, let's go ahead, push it, push it, push it. One, we're at 40 seconds left. Hell yes. We are officially pushing. We are officially surviving. This is going to be looking good. We are pushing past our past damage. Hell yeah. That is what I'm talking about. I knew a little bit of adjustment was going to go really far. That's what's up. Look at that. We got 20 seconds left. We're already past our, our previous damage. We're at 24 million. We got 14 seconds left. Let's keep doing that big damage, big damage. Oh, yeah. We are definitely pushing on really, really well, boys and girls. Come on, baby. Let's keep going. Hell, yeah. All right. Ooh, 24.5. Ooh. That's how you know you you're, you're basically did some good, good damage. All right, boys. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to make sure you guys like, subscribe, and share. Peace out.